hi guys welcome back to another video so today i am doing this set of nails in a greeny blue and yellow using pineapple fizz and blue teal color change so these little flowers that i got for this set are just paper paper flowers basically that i got off of ebay for somewhere else and i just thought i'd see if you could actually encapsulate these so i'm going on to this pinky nail with pineapple fizz and doing a full nail of that color so this is the blue teal from cjp which is a color change So I'm going in again with pineapple fizz on the point of finger. I'm just making sure that that is all fully covered. And then I've got this, it's like a teal glitter and I'm just going to dab that all over this nail. Because basically that's going to have some flowers on it. And then again on this one is that blue teal. So when I were doing these flowers, I did pick them up while they were dry. So I did about two and then realised that maybe if I'd put some monomer on them and wet them a bit, they'd bend a lot easier, which is what I do in a bit after fighting with these ones. I'm just putting a bit of clear over them. So these ones that I put on from now on are a bit wet, so they're a bit more bendier. I did cut some of these in half to put round sides, but that one just didn't want to stay there, so I just thought, ah, oh, well, I'll move it. But these were pretty cheap. I think these were about one pound fifty for fifty of these. On this nail, I'm just adding some clear acrylic and just adding the half of flowers, daisies. I think they were. So it is really late now, so I might sound a bit tired, but I fell asleep to be honest, so I just woke up and I thought, oh god, I need to do my voice off and get this video out. I'm just going to go in now with some of that um, greeny blue glitter I've got. And then in for capping. So this is a, a wet bee, believe it or not. So I'm just putting that in so that that will sink better into our little nooks and crannies. Nooks and crannies. <laughs> Where do I get that from? And then I'm just going to let that set a bit. And then I'm going to go in with a normal bead and just build that apex and strength on that nail. So I do go in and do all the rest of these nails and then I will be back just to file this nail for you. So as usual I'm doing side wall. And then underneath. Right, 
around that cuticle and then I do move on and do the full nail. to find a pair of gloves that I can't actually file through. See, stare at these. I just file through them every time. Make a right mess of them tips. So I've gone in and filed the rest of these nails, so I'm just going to top coat these. So as you can see, it worked really nice. So I might have to go on and buy some more of these paper things, paper arts and stuff. But yeah, once I've done this, I will cure this after I've just added a couple of little diamonds. And then I will just pop this into my lamp for a minute. And I will leave you with the final set. 